So joining us in the studio to discuss some of these issues from uh, the report size executive, the, um, the chairman uh, of uh, uh, so many things, including uh, you know uh, a, an election observer that we've known for so many years. Uh, it's also the chairman partner for electoral reforms, uh, Isenwa Wago. Uh, we've been with you on the field, and uh, you're here again. It's uh, almost on the match again to Edo State. First of all, what are your comments at this time? INX says it's ready, but what are your expectations as far as uh, Edo uh, governorship election is concerned? Well, Fisayo, thank you for having me. I, I, I think uh, both of us have appeared in different uh, obstacle elections. Uh, I think I remember in Undo, you were. You were there. What, what this means for me would be to simply put all the stakeholders in a do on the canvas and say, for instance, what are our expectations from the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC. They have responsibility to conduct free, fair, credible, acceptable and inclusive elections. Um, how prepared are they? That we are interrogating uh, because um, Barely a month to the election, uh, we expect that uh, from what we are seeing now, the PVC collection should uh, go on. We should be able to have that published, the exact number of uh, uh, PVC uh, collected. Um, we need to be very clear about the beavers, uh, their states, uh, their current states, and when they will be deployed, the issues of sensitive materials. We don't want to hear about pre-filled resources like we saw in, a, in Kogi. Um, we want to see clear internal governance mechanisms strengthened within the EMB in a way that inspires confidence in majority of voters in the state. But Edo is a tempestuous political state in terms of security. Um, apart from elections, there are as we speak right now, there are court-related fights uh, going on in, in, in some parts of the state. And what that means is to be able to isolate those fights and ensure that they are not uh, uh, become some kind of siege in the minds of uh, prospective voters. So the security agents uh, under the Intelligence Consultative Committee on Election Security should up the game and comb the state and ensure that uh, people who would want to cause trouble are reined in uh, right now. It's an off-cycle election, so at the attention of the world will be in Edo State. Um, we don't just want to hear that we have deployed 20,000 policemen, 11,000 NSDC. There has to be value for money. Um, if you deploy these numbers and there are security breaches, we should be able to hold somebody accountable.